Hey everyone, Cameron Tate for Outdoor Canada Magazine. Again, welcome to my kitchen. And you know what? It was amazing how many people sent me messages about Piper, my assistant here. And you know what? Maybe we're going to make her uh, a regular guest on, the, on these video series. What we're going to be doing today is a dish that I love cooking for summertime. It is a Vietnamese spring roll. And spring rolls don't always mean deep fried and heavy, heavy and everything else. This is such a simple dish and I'm going to show you how to do it. We've got really bright, colorful, tasty ingredients. But uh, it is so simple, you're going to be absolutely amazed. Okay, here we are. We're going on to the very first step. We've got our perch. They're cut in like little three inch uh, pieces or whole fillets, uh, if they're that size. I, I season it with kosher salt that has uh, much better flavor than just a regular iodized salt. And we're going to put some paprika in here and some black pepper. This is the only part of cooking in this dish. Uh, itself. So let's mix it in here and that's it. That's all you need to do. Let's come on over here and we've got a hot pan in here ready to go. Get it in your pan. All you have to do is this will cook so quickly you'll be amazed. So I'm going to go like this, toss it around a little bit, get your fillets right in there. The most important part is uh, we're not going to overcook this one here. Season it nicely. This is only going to be really a couple minutes and we're going to be stuffing it into our spring roll next. Okay, here we go. We're going to be making the filling for our spring rolls. So we got some beautiful mixed peppers here. We got some red, yellow, and green. I'm going to put that in there. And we've got our cucumber. So these are julienne strips. So they're really nice and thin matchstick. Put those in there. We have some thin mango. I'm gonna put that in there as well. And we've got some ginger and garlic. Another ginger that you can use is you can use this pickled ginger. It's just a little bit more flavor. Let's put that in there. And we wanna season it up with some salt and some freshly ground black pepper and Gives it nice, lots of seasoning is a sesame seed oil. I love this. All the uh, ingredients uh, are in the directions for the recipe. So really want to make sure that this is really nice and tasty and, and uh, seasoned nice. And that's it. I could almost eat this by itself, but we're going to get this ready to, to stuff in our rice paper rolls. Okay, here we go, off to wrap them. These are the rice paper rolls right here. You can get them in almost every single superstore or Safeway or Sobeys or whatever. Um, they're really cool. They can be um, just wrapped just by themselves uh, in, uh, in vegetables or you can deep fry them as well. So they're quite brittle. All you do is you just soak them in cold water for about 30 seconds. If you, if you see, they are quite fragile. So be delicate with them to start. Cold water, look at Piper, she's so excited. Let's give her a little piece of this perch because she's being such a good girl. Here Piper, good girl. Okay, so now we've got our lettuce, our mint, our basil, our cilantro, our mixed peppers, and then our rice noodles. Those rice noodles, they're so simple to cook. All you need to do is put them in a bowl, they're dried, Put them in a bowl with um, boiling water for five minutes. Drain them, cool them off, and you're ready to go. Okay, so your paper should be nice and pliable. It's almost ready to go. We got about another few more seconds. Let's just wait. Okay, so it's been sitting for about 30 seconds. If you take a look at it, it's really nice and pliable right now. Put that down on your cutting board. And let's get rid of this. So now what we're going to do is we're just building a wrap. So you can put any kind of lettuce down here. And then we can put our basil and our mint. I'll grab a mint leaf here and put that in there. And we can get a piece of the fish, the really nice perch. And then our seasoned vegetables. 
get a little bit of red color in there, like that. And then our chopped cilantro, which is going to bring this whole thing together. And then some sesame seeds, like this. And then all you have to do now is, oh, oh look at that, I almost forgot. Let's put our rice noodles in there. It's a little bit more filling. They're super delicate as well. Put that on there like that. So now we're going to take this. You can have it open on this end. You can have it closed. I'll show you an open one. Roll it up like that. And I tell you, this is an absolutely delicious, healthy summer uh, lunch, snack, dinner. And um, it's going to come with a, a dipping sauce, a, a chili dipping sauce. It is fantastic. Let me show you another one with it completely wrapped up. Okay, here we go. I'm going to show you uh, another one which is going to be completely rolled up. So you see that it is uh, almost very transparent and almost no calories in this thing whatsoever. So we're going to get, we'll put this right into the middle this time. Put this and then we'll put our fish. You can put as much as you want here. here. Our cilantro, all of these flavors make so uh, make such a great dish. And we'll put our mint, our mint in here, a little guy, and then our rice noodles, like that, and our toasted sesame seeds. You start off like this. You want to pull it nice and tight. Now we're going to go with this one over. And this one, and roll it up really tight. I don't know about you, this looks pretty fantastic. Our Vietnamese perch spring roll. Uh, it is so simple, and you know what? The best thing, if you have any of these ingredients left over, I'm going to toss them all in there and put a little bit of a sesame dressing on here, and I can have this as a side as well. This looks fantastic. Happy cooking.